A rare whale turned up dead near Everglades National Park last week. Now it's buried at Fort DeSoto, but not as a final resting place. That's because this is one of no more than 50 Brutus whales that live in the Gulf of Mexico. Biologists don't know much about them, except that they are genetically distinct from other types of Brutus whales. They've been proposed for legal protection under the Endangered Species Act. So when this 38-foot long one turned up dead near Everglades National Park, state and federal scientists seized the opportunity to examine it thoroughly. They spent two days cutting it open and taking samples and measurements. Then they trucked it across the state for burial at Fort DeSoto. In the spring, the Smithsonian Institution will dig up the skeleton and carry it back to Washington, D.C. to become the type specimen for all Gulf of Mexico Brutus whales. For the Tampa Bay Times, I'm Craig Pittman.